I feel like pay to win would be a more fitting name for an evil robot. Now here's the thing, right? And this is coming from an, um, mostly an F T F two P player, a free to play player, because I don't spend money on a lot of DLC or stupid microtransactions or any of that garbage. Because you know why? Because it makes you weaker. It gives you more OP shit. Sure, it could give you like cosmetics or maybe some quality of life stuff. But the majority of it is just DLC, power creep, pay to win. Payday 2 is a perfect example, right? You know why I'm so shit at the game? Because I keep buying that stupid DLC. Free to play player will spend more time, more effort, and actually be a stronger player. However, if he got all that DLC OP shit, he is 1000% better than a pay to win player. But that's just how capitalism works because all pay to win things anyways will just again have that inevitable power creep. The pay to win player is just stronger in the short term, not in the long term. A long term player, such as an F2P player, will always be better. No different than cheating. Anyways, let's go kick some ass. Prepare to die. Oh, you got me trans off the start? Cool. This will be easy. Hit them with more. Can I stagger you? You will fall to your knees, and I will finally see what true despair looks like. It won't end the way you want it to. I'll never give up. Can I hit you? You're really upset, aren't you? Just let it go. <laughs> One's not transformed. Why? Can I can I keep killing you? Can, are, can you stop pausing me? No, I'm about to kick your ass. Nope. You sure about that? I'm overpowered level, dude. I need healing, but it's too late. <laughs> Oops. I can't hold out. We're gonna have to do the tutorial all over again. Wait, it's over? You're right. I see. I see. I, I don't know what happened, but I think we're okay now. Wow, we really hit the ground running there, didn't we? And while I'm at it, your evil dealings end here, Hag 4. You came in at the last minute, and you're already taking all the glory. We could have expected as much. <laughs> so you're finally awake, goddess of Planetoon. Too bad. True destruction will start now. Hold on, that's really not gonna happen. You've said stuff like that like so many times before. <laughs> You'll find out soon enough. Hey, doesn't our boar look different? You win for today. I'll let you have your little planetoon. Hey, I said her name wrong and she didn't even acknowledge it. Is that really our boar? It is, but it isn't. No time to explain. We shall meet again. She jumped off? Damn! Get back here! She got away with that armored knight. We had her cornered too! Oh well, it's time for the nation to turn up and celebrate the return of its protag. Oh, 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 right, right, right. Streamer's supposed to say stuff too. Yes, hi, I'm still here. <laughs> that was a while. I forgot how easy uh, our snort was a, was a boss. It's just like pff, instantly died. <laughs> Didn't even stand a chance. F gears about to die, but we got a lot of. Uh... Oh dear. So we got Planetune, Planetune, Planet Tower. <laughs> Not super lively, but there's stuff. 
happening, I guess. There's more. There's a bunch of old people. <laughs> to steal a car or something. Yeah, there's plenty of cars on the road, clearly. Yo, I wonder about the offices. Are they lively? Wait, what's in here? Weapon and armor. Oh, shit. Dude, it's literally the weapon store in the CG artwork. Oh my fucking god, this is cool. This is awesome. Wow. Yo, it's got Uzume weapons. Got the frickin' megaphone. Holy shit. Got uni weapons. It's got obviously all the staff, spears, and swords you could ever have. Oh my god. This is so freaking cool. And they're all different too. It's this is sweet. I like looking at shit like this. This is cool. All the hologram. Ooh, this is all the stuff I'm wearing. So this is the... You can wear a horse head? Oh, dear. Oh, no. And there's a funny cat tail. It's a witch hat. Oh, my God. What if we had horse head with a button? And this must be all the items and armor and shit. Dude, this is so fucking cool. Look at that, look at that light shining on those nipples. We got friggin' RTX. Oh god, look at the textures. They're just clipping out. No! Savage. Damn, no RTX. Oh man, look at all the drugs. Alright. And then these are all the accessories I already have, so I can't buy horse hat chat. No horse hat. <laughs> oh, they got lots of cool glasses too. Got the... The fancy made headband, the headphones that I have on Nip Gear. There's all the toast. They literally put toast on display. But again, this place needs to be smaller or makes more sense or some sort of sprint. Super Dimension Sega Hard Girls has sprint for IF and Sagami. Oh, look, here's that bridge I was talking about for that uh, dungeon that we could have done. Wow, like they already made a frickin' bridge for this game. And it looks pretty functional to me. I was able to go under it, and I'm sure I can go over it. Even playing Ocarina of Time, the Hyrule field is smaller than this, and that thing was a chore to go through. Well, it's the stadium. It's the fucking arena. Stop spamming, Nupgear! Do, 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 do. Fuck, I could have sold that. Okay, yeah, I can do more of this later. It's been a while since I took a walk on the streets like this. It's so refreshing. <laughs> yeah, it's been a while since we took a walk like this together. Histy, feels kind of strange. Yes, well, let's not forget that Planetune was only recently liberated. We have to remain vigilant and patrol the area. Right, I guess that's why we're out here in the first place. Ah, Nepgear, Histy, look, look, the game shop is having a reopening sale. All right, Nep's gonna find herself some bargain bin treasures. Let's go. Hey, wait just one minute, Neptune. Hmm, some things never change. There she goes, flying off like usual. Yes, but seeing Neptune like this assures me that Planetune is finally returning to a state of normalcy. We shouldn't be too harsh. I guess you're right. It's thanks to her that things are beginning to feel like they're going back to normal. Well, Neptune? Has any game caught your eye? Zero zilch, not a hug. What a major bomber. I mean, look, this whole bargain bin is filled with nothing but Senmu 3. What? Senmu 3? What is it, Nepgear? Why are you yelling so loud? Because I didn't even know there was a third entry to that series. How did I not hear about it? I asked Verd about it the other day. Apparently it came out while we were sleeping. Indeed, the developers raised a record amount of money to fund development and bring the title to market. I see, but 
what's such a highly anticipated title doing here in the bargain bin? Well, to put it delicately, many felt the game was unable to keep up with current trends in the market. I played it and thought it was actually pretty fun. Seeing it in the bin like this though, what a shame. But it's been so many years and I'm just happy to have played it again. I'm sure we'll see it again someday. I'll just keep doing my best until then. He <laughs> says, the way you're talking about it, you must have thought Senmu 3 was a pretty great game after all. Yes, I agree. Okay, Neptune. You promised to do that, you do your best. I hope you prepare for that. <laughs> Just go easy on me, okay? I watched a streamer play Shenmue 1 and 2, and there was so much story roadblocks that pertained to money. You had to farm money. You had to do stuff to get money just to progress the game. And 90% of it was just gambling. Other was like some strenuously fucking stupid chore job, hard work, this, that, the other. And the whole Shenmue 3 is just like, yeah, let's just take people's fun money and like literally rob them out of a decent game. And yeah, the game was so clunky and bad. And clearly it's not kept up with standards and not a lot of people were happy with it. Sent refunds, did all this. Oh yeah, was Epic Games exclusive too? It's just like, holy shit. It was... I'm glad they're poking at that reference because holy crap, that is... Funny. Holy shit. I wanna go swimming. I wanna make Nep gear wet. Oh clearly. Clearly I have a solution for this. Hang on. Who's wearing my new outfit? <laughs> sad. Hmm. Nope. No injuries. I'm good to go. Damn. We can't go for a swim. Yeah. I don't have I don't have swimsuit permissions to swim. <laughs> this sucks. I can't jump! I can't swim? How big is this place anyways? Why's it random bricks? Is it just to give it random texture, I guess? I'm like quite amazed they finally put something like this. Cause I figured this would be like for like, um, for goddesses online, but this is nice. Just have a place just to run around like, like an idiot. What does that say? I want to say that says lotion or something, but I don't know. See, there's functional freaking bridges. Why couldn't they do that in that uh, tunneled corridor or dungeon? A triple decker house, or is this like some apartment duplex, that kind of thing? I wonder if they're gonna have like a dark version of this or something, and then there's gonna be like monsters everywhere. That's my guess, is like maybe they're gonna reuse this entire tile set or asset and uh, away they go, the kind of thing. Yo, there's a bike! I saw bicycles, now there's an actual bike. Holy shit, there's quite a few of them. It's Neptune, everybody. <laughs> That is very similar to that model. It probably is the same model, just reskinned. From Sega Hard Girls. Because that front visor looks almost identical, plus the handlebars, the shape, everything. That's gotta be it. Just reskinned. How about if I just hop on, it transfers me to a better game. And Sega Dimension is so goddamn good. Or. Oh, there it is. There's a purple bike. There's Neptune. See, they did have a purple bike. Clearly. It's right freaking there. The the paint is all screwed up. IF is gonna be mad. There, I found Neptune. Jump. Totally safe to jump down those stairs, uh huh? Uh huh. No secrets or any cool stuff underneath. They really gotta put some like interactables or like some random items or breakables because you can still use your weapon. Yeah, if they put, like, even just a little bit of, like, labels or stuff, or, like, posters, or funny pictures of characters. My chance of getting wet! The swimsuit still doesn't work! No! This sucks. Oh. No. Oh, no. Chat. Oh, no. Why? Why? Oh no. It's not safe to leave me here like this. <sighs> no. No, Nepku. You're not safe. You are not safe. Oh no. Why is it here? 
Why is it here? We have a problem. Why is it here? I'm scared. What do we do? Please don't stare. It's impolite. <laughs> but, Napgear, you do realize what we're looking at, right? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I'm gonna pretend I never saw that. Nope. 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 No! No! Oh, there's a... Wait, how do you get to the game center? What the fuck? Oh, it doesn't have the toy pop... Toyopolis music! No! At least the arcade machines are different than the ones in, uh... V2. Just reskinned, I guess. You can't jump on them. The seats actually are very similar to V2. I was missing a seat. That's interesting. I thought I was talking to a freaking vending machine, but I realized there's a person behind. <laughs> there's a person behind. Like some sort of maze. Wait, is that Uzume? Oh no, it's a fucking printy. Penguin's pool. Yeah, that's a fucking printy. Holy shit. Printy, dude. What's that? What's that one? Oh, there's another one too. Mana... Pori? Look at these go-karts go! Looks like those twins with the red and green hats have taken the lead! Whoa! Goshi's in there too! Those characters from a Louis game! This must be some kind of cosplay, right? Why are they racing around town in go-karts? I heard that blonde was planning some kind of demo event, but... There you are! I know that voice! Even after the court's rulings, they're still running idiotic stunts like this? I hope you're ready for a lawsuit. You're not going to get away with this. Sis, Rom, let's get them. Blonde, Rom, Ram. What in the world is going on here? We'll talk later. Rom, Ram, cover me. Ice coffin! They just froze over the streets. All the go-karts just slipped off the road. Rah! Whoa, the road caved in from the goddess's attack. All the drivers were flung into the air. Oh no, they're going to hit the ground head first. Ouch. Are you alright? Can you stand? Don't worry, Nepgear. I got this under control. She's right. These guys are all criminals. You don't need to be nice to them. So then these people are doing this without Blonde's permission? Yeah, the company runs a go-kart racket, and their name is stupid close to our title. They rent these cheap costumes too. We couldn't just let this happen. I lawyered up, and we won a ton of money in a high-profile court case. Despite all that, they never learn, so I've been cracking down on them myself. I see. Nobody, I mean, nobody wants to mess with Louis' super powerful legal department. Yeah, the last trial was pretty rough. What? Was there something else you went to court over? Yeah, it was an intellectual property case regarding our controllers. It ended up in a settlement, though. I see. That sounds pretty tough. Fighting legal battles one after another like that. You never know what could happen out there. You can never be too careful, Nepgear. <laughs> right. I'll keep that in mind. Thanks, Ram. Joy-Con Drift! Oh, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, of course, Nintendo going out for uh, funny Mario Kart said band makes, I guess. Damn, Blonde's pissed.